Lee Vey grew up in the city of Cottage Grove and was inspired to become a police officer by doing a ride-along with his sister Lisa. He served the city of Woodbury for 33 years and spent 15 of those years as the city's public safety director and police chief. Working with Lee was such a joy. He made the things we did fun. He knew how to challenge me in all the right way at the right time and in the right manner. And he made us just so much better. He saw the positive, even in the tough situations, he could see opportunity where many of us would see challenge. Post George Floyd was a challenging time for America and for public safety. Lee has always followed the department's motto of leading the community and treating people with compassion and courage. Lee agreed to meet with Tim Brewington and have the Cable Commission film a very natural, in some cases raw, interview about policing, race, and equity. There's not many people in the country that have that, that legal authority to do that. Right. And when you have that legal authority to do that, you have this incredible obligation, moral obligation and legal obligation, to, to take care of that person. Right. It's as simple as that. And it meant so much to so many people. And much respect for him. I mean, that type of courage and leadership is what we need in this community, and, and Lee represents that. Under Lee's leadership, the department went through a lot of changes. One major change was merging the police, fire, and ambulance service into a public safety department. His priority has always been to maintain a high level of customer service. I've always just felt really confident that we are in really good hands under Lee's leadership in our community. We are all very fortunate for that. He's very open and honest about things that are going on. He tells it like it is, but has that calming and reassuring manner about him. Under his tenure, a number of new programs and services were added to meet the needs of the community. Like the police and mental health worker co-response, implementation of body-worn cameras, the creation of the Multicultural Advisory Committee, and the construction of the Hero Center training facility. I work with Lee with the Multicultural Advisory Committee where members of the community can come together and share their experience it has been extremely valuable. Lee will end his career as the longest serving public safety director in the city's history. Oh, Lee's going to be missed in so many ways. Some of it's just his unique, sometimes quirky and fun personality. Lee's just uh, brought some life and energy and positivity to that role. And for that, we're going to miss it. Lee's ability to lift people up uh, will be very missed. His just character, he has a deep sense of ethics and caring of people. And he loved his team and he would practically do anything to help support them. Lee has changed my view of policing in this area, and I think Woodbury is in a position to be a model community for other cities in our state and the country. He will be missed in our community.